welcome back to my channel it's Lexi Kareem if you didn't know now you know in today's video I want to be showing y'all me getting ready getting my suite ready for um you know braiding and stuff like that I actually let me sit down because I'm actually tired and it's hot So, um, I got my sleep, I viewed my sleep, um, on September 6th, I viewed it, came in, did a little tour and everything like that, um, asked all the questions that I needed to ask, and I end up signing the lease that following week on September the 15th, so I've had it for <clears throat> about four months, well, going on five months, um, and I haven't decorated at all just because me being pregnant um I've been really really tired and after work and stuff I just go home and go to sleep but I have been buying stuff you know and bringing it here um some stuff at least bringing it here and stuff like that so today I actually have time today I'm actually just going to set up some stuff i have this um shelf that's behind me i have that that i need to put up and i also have just like some small little decor stuff that i'm gonna start putting up. after baby i do want to go ahead and start working out of my suite full time so that's why i'm trying to get everything ready before march so yeah um let me show y'all what it looks like so it's a suite it's a building um it's a suite inside of a building so i'm surrounded by a lot of other suites and the bathrooms and restrooms and all that is just outside that door my back door so this is the front door it's so hot in here i don't think i can work this but um yeah so you walk in that's this little window and then i have you just walk in i feel like i am gonna divide it into two sections so i'm gonna have a divider just dividing the space into two just so i can do hair back there and we up here it's gonna be kind of like a um, lounge area or whatnot where i have my calendar my stuff my paperwork for my clients to sign or whatever before i start doing hair um just some other stuff that's gonna go up here but it's not focusing i don't know why there we go but as you walk they did paint the walls white i did want them white um i told them i wanted them white so they painted them white but i am going to i have some um paper what's it called i have some paper um wallpaper stick on wallpaper that's gonna come in and i'm just gonna decorate the walls with that just to give it more of a statement a statement rather than just plain white walls because most of my furniture is white so as you can see my chair is white and then i have that desk chair right there but this is white that's white so yeah this is the first thing that i'm gonna set up and then after i finish doing that i will show y'all what it looks like i'm gonna show y'all me doing it but after i do that you know i'll show y'all but yeah i'm finally i'm excited that i'm finally doing this i finally have a lot of energy to um actually come into my space and bring it into life i've been creating um like vision boards of how i wanted to look and stuff like that grabbing ideas off of pinterest and you know just planning a board of how i wanted to look um visually so i'm excited that i'm finally at this point to where i can actually do 
what I really want to do. So, I update on my pregnancy. I am 33 weeks now. So, baby girl is coming real, real soon. So, we got to get this done. But, um, I'm excited about that. So, I'm going to take it light. I promise I'm not overworking myself or <laughs> working, you know, doing something that I'm not supposed to be doing. Um, so, that's just a disclaimer right there. But, I'm going to just go ahead and start taking this stuff down, opening this box. It's so hot, like right here. I want to close this vent because that's hot as hell. Oh, they got the heat going. I'm about to turn it off because it's hot. But, um, yeah, I'm about to start taking this off. So, y'all can see it's my belly, y'all. She's so big. But, watched a video on how to set everything up so I kind of know what everything is so far I don't have to like go in depth with the instructions I'm a, one thing about me I am a visual learner so once I see something I pretty much got it so but <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and take out all the pieces And I just have a 12 cube, so this is how it looks. Just a 12 cube shelf. And you can really um, design it however you want it to, but I'm gonna do four rows across, three rows going down. So, that is that. I'm gonna first start by dividing the um, all of the pieces, like separating it like from A, B, C, D by letters, so. Let's start doing that. I don't know where they put the letter. Oh. This is A, I guess. Alright, so these are all the pieces, y'all. So I'm about to put it together and then I'll come back when I'm finished. Alright, so so far I got the first um shelf down packed. And it's pretty much pretty easy from here. All you do is just repeat the steps two more times and then it'll be finished. So that is what I'm about to do here.
This is the top of the shelf, and I don't really want that showing. And I'm gonna just take this mallet and kind of um, tap it in place. Just like that. And this is how it looks. So now I just have to do the sides. So I'm about to flip it over on one side just to do these last two pieces right here and then that'll be it all right so this is the shelves um the only thing i have left to do is to put these on the back like block it off like to close it some will be open some will be closed so i'm gonna figure out how i want that to be and then i'm gonna go ahead and put those on and then this is just like cardboard so so I got these three little bands. They don't fit inside of um the shelves. So I have to go. I got them from Target. So um I got them to put my towels in my yeah my towels in that I use to you know dip my braids and all of that towels or my bonnets um that I have. But I'll have to go back to the store and get clear. I've seen some clear ones as well that I'm just going to put inside of here. And then this will be um, in front of the wall uh, wallpaper. It's black and white. Everything in here will be black and white. It's very minimalistic. Um, my aesthetic is sunflowers, of course. Um, that's the thing with my, um, business, but I didn't want to decorate in all sunflowers because I was thinking about what if I, um, decide to rebrand or something like that. I didn't want to go through with doing a full makeover or, um, nothing like that. So... That is why I just chose to do everything black and white with, with hints of yellow and stuff like that and um, greenery and stuff, you know. But I'm just glad that I got that done because now I can see how um, everything is going to come together with the wallpaper and stuff like that. The wallpaper and the divider that's going to go um above i will actually like the lighting here it's pretty light but it's gonna go above the lighting i mean on the lighting thing 
it's gonna be just like a little curtain divider it's gonna be black um with the floors i don't know what i want to do with the floors yet i don't know if i want to get a rug or if i want to um do tiles on the floor so that is something for me to figure out but as far as now um i do have um a braiding rack it's wood but i am getting one from amazon it's more acrylic clear um so you can kind of see how the that it's going to be like black and white clear all the clears acrylic looking stuff and um yellow yellow accent pieces yellow um decor pieces sunflowers and all of that i have to make a photo wall i don't know if i want to do that um kind of up here like before they leave you know take a picture um so i don't know <laughs> with that part but um i'm excited to see how everything comes together this is just the beginning this is just a few little pieces main pieces that i wanted to go ahead and get out the way so you know when i'm coming here with baby to package up orders and stuff because i do have new products dropping as well but when i come up here to work and stuff to do orders and all of that um everything will be finished i won't have to do any big you know decor pieces and stuff right now i don't have to do all of that um i am traveling right now with braiding um i'm slowing up now just because it's getting closer to baby to come but i'm slowing up right now but i'm excited for this to come together i see the vision um i'm just excited i'm just ready to get everything finished like you know finished 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 um so i'm gonna bring my bonnets in and put those in the bins that's not the bins aren't going to stay there now that i know it won't fit um i have to find somewhere to put those and i don't know where it might stay on top of there i don't know but we'll see um i have like some acrylic trays that i wanted to put in between there to for like beads and where my beads my bows my for my little girls you know my beads my bows my rubber bands and all of that i have these clear trays that i don't really use for that let me see they're like this and they're stackable so you just stack it however you want to do it um so yeah this is what i'm going to put my my beads in and all of that and i'll go to target and get some more clear um bigger trays to fit inside of that little shelf um, and i got these clear little clips to go excuse my hair y'all i've been sleeping on it because i haven't been wanting to do anything to it but this is just a sewing that i did and when i wanted to look real, real cute i just recurl it or whatever but um as of right now girl i've just been wearing it however sleeping on it whatever but um yeah these clear hooks are gonna go on the wall because i am gonna be hanging my all of my braiding hair on the wall um i did want to minimize having a lot of bins in here so I don't want to just have bins everywhere so that'll be like a storage place is on the wall I will be having my hair on the wall somewhere on the wall um and then just like these clear acrylic little hooks self-adhesive hooks that just clip on the wall and stuff like that and then this right here is just my calendar that I will be hanging on the wall as well. It's upside down, but that's my calendar just to keep me updated about who I'm seeing on the day or what I have to do on that day, you know, you know. So I'm excited about that. Um, what else do I have? Um, 
have these little black and white bins as well. I can probably throw dirty towels in here, the ones that I already used. Um, I can throw the dirty ones in here. Or I can, um, I don't wonder if it um, fits in here. It actually does. Let me see. So it actually fits in there. <laughs> I don't know what I will do with it in there, but it fits in there. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But my chair, I just love my chair. Like, it was so hard for me to find this. I found it on Amazon. Um, that's just all my stuff, but it's real nice. I love it. And then a TV will be up there. And then the divider will be here. And stuff like that. But I'm excited for y'all to kind of see going along on the journey with me decorating stuff and kind of seeing everything get put together because i know it's kind of empty right now but honey my vision is going to come together and everything is going to be perfect so nothing is perfect but everything is going to be good so i'm going to clean up this little stuff um i have like little i think i cut myself i don't know how i cut myself um let me go and get these bonnets out of my car and see if I have a hot glue gun in my car. So I can go ahead and put these um, acrylic trays together. And then after I get everything actually in here, I will start bringing in my inventory stuff like hair, my braids, my bonnets. Uh, I won't bring my bonnets in now, but some of them. Because I like to keep some on me in my car because I do travel braid right now. Yeah, my lips are so ashy. It's a brain symptom, sorry. You know. But yeah. Um, I even forgot what I was saying, but yo yeah, some of the bonnets I like to keep on hand because I like to um you know, if the client wants to get it while I'm traveling. I can give it to them. I have it in my car. Um, yeah, let's go get this out of my car. I need my key. I like that my car is like right here. Like I don't have to go far. Let's see. I don't know if I have. Um, Here, I don't know what I got right here. Ooh. this little thing here just says ancient spire but um yeah I don't know what I'm gonna do with these they're pretty big I'm gonna clean them off but that's just a little little piece I got I had that for a while that was in my old room but girl I got so much stuff in here so like for my bonnets, I can have these in here. Some of my, um, I forget, I forgot my, my battery's about to die. I forgot my other ones at home. They're the special edition, but I'm gonna just figure this out. And then on my next video, I will show y'all um, more of the decor pieces and everything. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video with me just getting together a few little things for my suite. Um, 
I will see y'all in my next entrepreneurship video. So I hope you guys liked this one. If you did, go ahead and like this video and subscribe for more. Um, and I'll see y'all in my next one. Thank you guys for watching. See you later. And my clients don't have to park Florida. Like they can literally park right here in front of the door. But back. Let's see. I don't know if I have. Um. Let's see what I have in here. I don't even know what I got right here. Ooh. This little thing here just says ancient spire, but um, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do with these, they're pretty big. I must clean them off, but that's just a little, little piece I got. I had that for a while, that was in my old room, but girl, I got so much stuff in here. Okay. But yeah, so like for my bonnets, I can have these in here. Some of my, um, I forget, I forgot my, my battery's about to die. I forgot my other ones at home. They're the special edition, but I'm gonna just figure this out. And then on my next video, I will show y'all um, more of the decor pieces and everything. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video with me just getting together a few little things for my suite. Um, I will see y'all in my next entrepreneurship video. So I hope you guys liked this one. If you did, go ahead and like this video and subscribe for more. Um, and I'll see y'all in my next one. Thank you guys for watching. See you later.